This is a short video on pre-AP essential skill number two, electron configuration and noble gas notation. Uh, some of you have already covered in general chemistry in some of the last units. So what we're going to do is we're going to briefly cover it and um, hopefully remind you of how this needs to be done. And you'll have to write some of these on the test. So I want you to notice that uh, that the 1s, or actually just the s block is over here, and as you move across, that the uh, helium is actually over there. So 1s, and you just work it across. 1s2, 2s, 2p, 3s, 3p, and just like reading a book, left to right, 4s, and then you hit 3d. Remember that the d block is n minus 1. That's one of the tricks. 3d, then back up to 4p. 5s, 4d, and when you get to 6s, before you go to d, you need to come down to the f block, and that is n minus 2. Okay. Now, something that might help you, and this is a... Uh, it might, I don't know, but if you write out your, in each line, so 1s, and then 2s, 2p, so the s, s, and p. You have for each one, when you write it, the order you have to go in is like a zigzag line. You can see it's cutting through each one, and you loop back up, you come through again, you loop back up, you come through again. And so some students have found this to be helpful. It reminds them in exactly what order they need to write it. So um, that's all well and good, but let's see the actual practical application of this. So I'm going to put these back up out of the way. Let's bring down the big periodic table here. And we're going to pick on arsenic. And arsenic is right here. And the electron configuration for arsenic, I'm going to put it right below here. If I can, there we go. And remember, you have to start and go through, start with hydrogen. You have to start with hydrogen each time. So 1s, whoops, let me get the pen going. 1s1, 1s2, so that you write 1s2. Then you start over again, over here. 2s2, 2p6. 2s2, 2p6. Start over again. 3s2, 3p6. That's those ones. 4s2, and then you go to, once you get through 4s2, you're going to have to get into the D block. 3d, remember, it's n minus 1. I can't emphasize that enough. And then 4p1, 2 Three. Now, the noble gas notation, you have to take the noble gas from the row right above. And in this case, if R6 is right there, argon is the noble gas right above that. So you would put argon in parentheses, and what that does is that encompasses all of argon's electron configuration, which is that right there. Argon, and then you would write up 4s2. 3d10 and 4p3. And that's how you do the noble gas configuration or the noble gas notation. Uh, so your essential skill is to be able to write both the electron configuration of an element given to you and a noble gas notation. Uh, if you have any questions, please see your teacher. Thank you.